Hey guys, welcome back. I got you propped up on some boxes here because I only got my one arm available. I come on, I'm a little flabbergasted. I, I don't even, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. So I let a friend take my Zencraft Black Dahlia home to journal for me in my multi-year that's been in here. I got it back. <laughs> See this? Oh. The elastics have been cut out. There's no elastic to wrap it. Guys, <laughs> I'm sure you've seen one of my previous videos with this beauty in there. Uh... It was very sleek with a few cracks and it was absolutely gorgeous the way it came. And over time of my using it, some of the um, the black wore off. Nothing to this extent. Nothing to this extent. Um, so anyways, I sent it off with a friend and she was supposed to journal for me while I was down due to my shoulder surgery. She handed it to me. And I was just dumbfounded. Like, my mouth dropped. And I was like, what'd you do? <laughs> what What in the actual hell did you do to my notebook? Now, granted, she doesn't understand traveling notebook world. And she said, <laughs> when I gave it to her, it had little peelies on it and it was driving her nuts so she started peeling off the little peelies because this um at, at the time as it was cracking the black was just like peeling up off of it i wish i wish i had a video uh a photo so i could put it right next to this i'm sorry i'm standing behind my camera trying to make sure it stays in frame and i'm looking at it and not at this. So she done peeled it. But then. It, it is so floppy now. Like there is. No structure whatsoever. Left to it. It just is like a floppy mess. So it looks like. She not only rolled it. But also like. She put it in a ball and smushed it, and it gave it some pretty unique character. But the original beautiful aspects of it are are gone. It's like you can't even see the the main cracks that were in it originally. It's can you see? It's stretched like out of proportion and. Um, like, you see all the wrinkles? This was a extremely flat, flat piece of leather. And now it feels like a bomber jacket. It really does. It is so floppy. And it's, like, <laughs> honestly, it's a great memory to never let her do touch my books ever again. <laughs> But, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with it now. It's I'm obviously going to continue to use it. But, has this ever happened to you guys? It's original character is just gone. There's, <laughs> I want to show you kind of what I'm talking about. Where is my small little... I don't see it. Son of a biscuit. I bet I'm all sitting right here. Y'all gonna have to, like, jump through with this thing and make me be on my game. Because I can never find what I'm looking for. Anyways, it kind of, like, had, like, a lightning strikes that were really noticeable on the pocket. And they weren't... Uh, 
they did they they, they looked kind of like a crack but they weren't a crack it was a natural flare but yeah now i've gone from a very sleek to a very lumpy bumpy rustic-y looking tn that's kind of wonked out of shape and uh no elastic bands <laughs> i'm sure i can do something with these little guys you know but she didn't even take the time to untie them she just <laughs> cut them right out oh and the kicker is the bookmark's gone when yo make these this is from zencraft uh johanan or johanan i can't but I, he likes yo um when he makes these, he inserts a string bookmark that is tied lightly at the top and it comes down with two strings. So it has two evenly length strings and there's a handmade, uh, it's not handmade, it's a little hand that says handmade on them. Um, I can show you on this one what I'm talking about. If I can hold it in one hand. Do you see? Isn't that the cutest? I'm trying to get it to focus. It won't. But it's just a little itty bitty hand. Oh, sorry, bumped you. There we go. And it says handmade on it. Gone. Just gone. We don't know where that is. What would you do if this <laughs> was one of your precious's and it's returned to you like so and it's just like <clears throat> it smells phenomenal still. It still smells like a great leather but it's definitely not the way it was sent and it looks like she tried to force the button closed and this wrap happened to be in the pocket so that's got a another new beauty mark there you can see where the lines right here that's the um pocket thought I could just barely see the original streaks but you can't so yeah it, it irritated her and she got picking and picking and picking I guess she couldn't help herself you know I'm not angry I'm not angry at all I'm just speechless as and like why it's not yours <laughs> don't do that <laughs> so yeah there's that. There's my little conundrum of the day. It's like not even a problem compared to what's going on in the world. You know, but that happens. <laughs> and I'm 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 not I'm not laughing cuz it's funny. I'm laughing cuz I'm just like blown away. <laughs> Who does that? <laughs> Oh, yeah. Now I gotta find some elastic and get it all put back together. I don't know where any of the stuff that was in here went. Because if you remember from a previous video, I had stuff in the pockets to try to protect the button, the buttons, 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 and, the, and keep it as flat as possible so it would wear more naturally. It's gone. All the stuff is gone. I got my journal back. I got my cover back. Definitely a little worse for the wear compared to what it was. You know. It's very soft. I will say that. It's very, very mushy. Very like huggable. Want to wrap it around your shoulders. And this is very creamy feeling now. I don't know. I'm just keep on. 
talking just because I don't know what else to do. <laughs> All right. I've, I, I don't, I don't even know. I don't know how to flatten this. I don't know how to rectify it in any way, but I will love it for the way it is right now because it is now a memory and a lesson and a unique beauty. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thanks for coming by, and I hope you're staying safe and healthy. I'm going to put a couple more video ups, videos up soon. I had an unboxing of my um, Jellio that was up. I don't know what happened to it, but it's gone. So I will try to do a review of that. I just got a new to me speckled fawns wagon trail with nice little hole for my weeks and this is again absolutely beautiful so I will do a review on that um, I got a planner coming from the planner exchange which is a great program I'm going to do a unboxing on that and show you guys Tell you guys how it works out and show you about it. It's a Jillio that I got coming. That's a medium XL. It's a rent option where you can rent planners and traveler's notebooks and stuff. So I will share that with you guys. I promise. And I will do some journal with me's or like plan with me's because people um, are really intrigued by my way of um, like journaling and how I chub up my notebooks because that's a thing and they are just juicy and delicious when they're chubbed up. So I will share that with you guys. Um, and I will do a giveaway. I, I, I am planning on doing that. Um, just not sure yet which way I want to go with either planner stuff, bag stuff, journaling stuff, um, but I will do that. I will do a separate video on that. Um, it will be in a chit chat. Chit chat. I won't say that it's a giveaway. Because I don't want anybody and their brother just coming to my channel just because, excuse me, giveaway is in the title. You know, you know what I mean? Um, or I might put it in the first chit chat so you guys, everybody gets a chance to understand the chit chat. That's my thing. I'm creating that. If somebody else has done it, no no disrespect for you, to you or trying to steal anything from you. I just sat here and came up with the idea of let's do my giveaways as a chit chat type video. So if you can think of any questions you want to know, plop them in the bottom or save them for the chit chat video because I will ask you to put a question in for the um, giveaway section. I will ask questions on that and maybe you can answer them in the bottom. But um, yeah, any, if, if you have anything from now, just stick it in the bottom. Hit like, subscribe if you wouldn't mind. Um, up to 33 subscribers, which is ecstatically awesome. Like, I'm, I'm boggled. I think you guys are amazing. Um, so yeah, hit the bell if you want to. That's still an option. <laughs> if you've already hit it, thank you. Good luck to you guys with dealing with me. All right. So stay safe, stay healthy, keep being creative, smile on, share them smiles with people, get everybody in a better mood. Alrighty guys. Love you. Bye now.